people hope you are doing well welcome back to my channel it's me so henry back again with a new video if you're new here please consider subscribing this is a channel where we do health and also we do lifestyle so guys today i'm back and i'm back with a new video and today i'm showing you how how to use a twin tub to clean your pillows at home guys uh it's not a must that you take your pillows to laundry no that's expensive you can do it at the comfort of your home so guys i'm going to be doing it in this video i'll be cleaning my fiber white pillows i'll be cleaning only two on the video and the rest i'll do it of the video you'll see how fulfilling it is how clean the pillow gets so guys stay tuned give us a thumbs up and remember to subscribe like share and comment let's do this after I obviously filled the wash tub with water, I added my powdered soap of choice and then allowed it some time to mix. Even if you add your liquid wash washing soap, it doesn't mix automatically. You have to give it some time for, for it to mix. As you can see, it's mixing with water. Then after that, I'll take my jig. This is the regular jig. This is what I use for cleaning my pillows. As you can read the instructions, it has how to use in a front in a front loader and a top loader, which is a twin tub washing machine. So read the instructions before you use. I added one cup. After adding, you allow it also to mix with water and the powdered soap. It's mixing and then you put in your, your pillows. As you can see, my pillows has some stains. I don't think you can see because of the light. But it's dirty. So you soak the first pillow inside the water. Inside the mixture of soap jig and water i soak both of them together so that the laundry can be fast it also have some stains i'm soaking it as the first one is cleaning Once you ensure that both pillows are covered by water, you now put your timer on to the desired time. I put for 15 minutes the full cycle. As you can see guys, the pillows are cleaning. We give it 15 minutes for the first cycle. The first cycle is over so what I do here I usually turn my pillows to the other side the top side now goes to the bottom and the bottom side becomes the top so that I can ensure that the pillow is fully cleaned and then after that I'll close the tub and give it another full cycle for cleaning 15 seconds, 15 minutes I mean. That's the second cycle now. The second cycle is over, so it's time to spin. So as, as I did with the squeezing of water with the clothes, the same thing happens here for the pillows. You Place the pillow in the spinner with water because you can't be able to squeeze the pillow off water. Yeah, it's very heavy. As you can see, it's heavy even to transfer it. Press it down so that it can balance in the spin tub. Remember to always place your spinner lid. I 
never forget to place your spinner lid after placing the spinner lid you will close the spinner and spin for around like four to three minutes so that you can squeeze the water out the pillow because it's not possible for you to squeeze manually so it's now squeezing after squeezing i'll put the pipe on the inlet to the spinner so that i, I can allow water in and rinse my pillow it's just the same process as the one for washing your clothes using this twin tub so after squeezing the water i'll allow water in as you can see the water is running in the spin tub so that i can rinse the cloth the pillow I allow some time water to flow in so that it, the pillow can be soaked with clean water and then I allow it to rinse for 5 minutes. You can also allow it to rinse for more than 5 minutes. You can rinse as much time as you want. I had not finished my fresh juice so I still continue to enjoy myself as I wait for 3 more minutes for my pillow to continue rinsing. So by now the pillow has rinsed so I'll add my fabric softener I'll add as much as I feel is enough for me and also to ensure that the pillow smells nice I will then allow two minutes for the fabric softener to spin and then after that I'll allow another five minutes so that I can spin the pillow and air dry it now I'm putting the 5 minutes so that it can be air dried. You can also allow more time as you wish. And by now the 5 minutes are over and the pillow is dry. As you can see guys I'm removing it from the spinner. The pillow is dry but so much attached to each other the fibers attached to each other so it needs you to beat it up and rub it together so that they can separate as I'm doing I'm doing this so that it can separate the fibers can separate when you look at my pillow it's very clean as white pure white and when you squeeze it no water at all it's almost dry only that it's damp but when you squeeze it even how much you can squeeze it no water can come out you can see it's just as white pure white even the ends and the lining at the end is clean it's clean and smells fresh it smells good if you have a, a clothes dryer you can use it to dry the pillows for the remaining part you can also air dry them on the sun or also the wind is enough for them to dry because it's 97 percent dry So clean and so fulfilling. How much you can ever squeeze these pillows, they cannot remove any water. No water can come off the pillows, and it's so fulfilling. So thank you guys for watching, remember to subscribe, like, share and comment and until the next one, peace and remember to stay safe and wear your mask, sanitize your hands and wash them.